Welcome back to Writing Done Right. We have a little bit of a different video today because I happen to have an unboxing. We have the new copies of Synaptogy are in. So it's always a gamble. Are they gonna be good? Are they gonna be bad? We just don't never know. So we'll kind of talk about what happens if we do get a couple misprints and uh, things like that. Now, this stack came from Amazon because there's right now the uh, craziness of the world. It's uh, some places are much slower to build up. Some places are are much quicker to ship things. It turns out that right now in the current uh, environment, Amazon's the quicker to ship. I have some coming from Ingram Spark. They haven't even shipped yet, as far as I know. But uh, these guys are already in. Now I ordered um, 15 copies of the Synapse G book. I also ordered five copies of several other editions of books just to make sure I have enough inventory here for anybody that places an order. So let's go ahead and uh, get started. We're gonna go ahead and uh, cut this guy up and uh, see what we get. That's all right. Let's get this guy opened up, see what we get. All right, so we're nice and packed up here. So like Amazon, they always give us more stuff than we actually need. So uh, what we actually have here is, uh, if you notice inside here, we actually have just a series of gaps here and a bunch of books. So let's have a look at what we got. First, let's go with the ones we, we've already have some in stock. I just wanted to get a couple extras. So these are um, a couple copies of Josiah's Sanctification. And uh, what I'm noticing here is that, yeah, some of these guys are really off center on their print. Um, so if we see that, sometimes, uh, sometimes they're bad enough we don't really want to do much with them. Sometimes um, it's like, hey, no big deal. So here's, I'm going to show you what these look like here. So some of them are okay. This guy here, you can tell, is very off center. The other ones here are absolutely fine. This one here might also be off center. So I'm gonna pull these two up and I'm going to investigate the two on the top. These guys here, the bottom three, they look just fine. So let's do a quick look at those guys. All right, so I'm gonna to look to see if there's any white around the edges. That'll tell you if they've cut them wrong. Looking at the back, everything is right in front of the crease. So this one, these are the first three, are perfectly fine. So absolutely appropriate copies of books. These guys here, you'll see this one here has this white, big block of white right there on the cover. This is a serious misprint. So uh, I'm gonna have to think about this. If there's only like one misprint, I might just throw this up here as a sam sample copy. Uh, it's also cut, you can kind of see that the white, let me flip sides so you can just see the, the cover there. You can see that it's actually even printed slanted. So this one's actually bad enough to probably go back. Um, so if you get one like this, you know, don't get mad about it. You just got to reach out to him and be like, hey, you know what? A couple of these are, are too off center. This guy here, I'm not seeing any white around the edges. It is a little off. I'm going to say that this is going to probably pass my quality control. A little off, but not enough to bother me. This guy here, that's a bad misprint. We're going to set this aside and um, contact them about sending that one back. All right. We also got five copies of Happy Holidays in. So once again, we're going to flip on over and have a look at the, I'm just going to look at the center binding first. That's going to tell me the first, uh, first thing. Looks like all of these are very well centered. So I'm not anticipating any of these to be misprints at all. Um, go ahead also though and double check the insides, make sure the insides look good. And in reality, yeah, insides, uh, these look really good. So none of these are misprints. I'm very happy with, uh, very happy with all these copies. So beautiful. Perfect. Love them. Those are great. All right. Um, I thought I had, let's see, five of those, five of those. Maybe that's all I had. So I think maybe everything else in here is the new science fiction novel. So that'll be exciting. This is the first time I'm having a look at it. So here we go. Here is the new science fiction novel, Synaptergy. This cut looks really good. You can see the center binding. It's nice and uh, nice and centered there around the side. And uh, you can kind of tell exactly where I was, exactly where I faded it um, into the edge. If you remember the video where we did the cover on this, 
it's fading right exactly the fold. This is a perfect print. So this guy is awesome. Here's our back cover. And it looks like it's coming right up to the edge, right where it should be. So there's my back cover. There's my front cover. And here's my insides. So this book here, I'm extremely happy with the way it turned out. Yeah, very nice, very nice book there indeed. So that is a perfect copy of Synaptergy. Let's have a look at a couple more of them here. So we got four more in this stack. Let's just have a look at these guys. Get them all lined up. Checking again for the misprints. These guys here all appear to be very centered. I'm not seeing any white along the sides. These guys look excellent. So excellent, excellent, excellent copy. All right, so very happy with that chunk. We got another chunk over here, five copies over here. All right, so you'll see this bottom one is a little out, out of whack. Um, and actually this one right next to it. So you can kind of look if I'll focus in on these guys. Let's see if I can get the camera to focus on them better there. So why don't you spot about two of these guys, and it's these two here, is that the fold, the print is way up high on those, those folds. So let's have a look at these two here. So I'm going to look at these. Once again, we see some white up here on the cover. And this one actually has a pretty bent cover there, so I wouldn't want to sell this one. The question is, if I only have one or two of these like this, I might just keep them and just send them as display stuff. Um, so this one's not super bad. It's it's a little off. There's clearly white on it, and there shouldn't be any white. Um, you can spot again. You can see where the fold line is supposed to be. How get this guy to focus there. And see where the fold line's supposed to be there, where uh, it's way off on the fold. So these two there are candidates to consider sending back. We'll have a look. These other three, perfect. They're just fine. So set those aside. And I have one more stack to look for. All right. So of these guys... Just based on the folding, it looks like the bottom one there is a little off. You can kind of see how that's not as centered. This one's a little off here in the center, but not a lot. My guess is this one's going to be perfectly fine. It's just a little off center. A little off center, I don't mind if it's a little off center. So I'm going to inspect this guy. Not seeing any white, so that one's just fine. This guy's just fine. This guy's just fine. And we have one more here where you can kind of see the white around the edges. And so this guy there might need to go back as well. So overall in this order, I think I've ordered uh, 35 books in this, wait, 25? I think I ordered 15, or 25. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. So I have ordered 25 books and four of my 25 books are misprinted. So with that many in the order misprinted, um, I am actually going to reach out to Amazon and um, we'll go ahead and find out what we can do about those. So that's what to look for. Um, now, this is actually the first time I've had misprints ever that I feel are, are uh, bad enough that I need to contact the company back and figure out what we want to do. Um, I'll look at these guys. What One thing I might do is I might just ask people, hey, I have a couple misprints, and uh, if people don't mind a misprint copy, maybe I'll just do that. I might reach out to Amazon and find out if it's, if it's easy enough to send them back and have them send me a few more. I might do that. Um, it depends on how many. Now, as far as misprints, this is, like I said, the first time I've ever had misprints. I've ordered lots of books from Amazon. I've ordered lots of books from Ingram, and this is actually the first time I've actually seen any of these that are that are this bad. So uh, we'll look at it, and uh, I'll let you guys know what I decided to do. Uh, but anyway, Synaptergy is in stock and uh, ready to go. Uh, I think most of these are already pledged to my um, beta readers, especially since i got to look at what I'm going to do with three of these here. 
And uh, with that, I will go ahead and say that there's a few more available. So you can, uh, I'll leave the link in the description down here if you want to pick up one of these copies directly from me. And if so, leave a note there on the website and I'll go ahead and sign it. So uh, there is an unboxing of Amazon books from Amazon. Overall, very happy with it. We got to figure out about these five books here. That is, uh, what's it, four books, four books here. That's a significant chunk of the, of the uh, order, but uh, we'll see what they want to say about it. So thanks for coming along and I hope that we have taught you how to get your writing done right.